It's me, Mario! Hey guys, Miss Sainelli here with something that a lot of you have already seen me play, but in way different context. We'll be covering the ever-loved classic of the N64 era, Super Mario 64. But this series is going to have a pretty unique perspective, I think. As a chunk of you probably already know, at the date of posting this video, I pretty frequently stream 16 star speedruns of Super Mario 64 on Twitch. However, that's the extent of my knowledge on this game. Otherwise, my experience with it is limited to what I saw my mom play when I was a really, really young kid, plus the few times that I picked it up just to derp around in some of the stages. So, put simply, I'm pretty okay at the mechanics, but I really have no idea what the extent of this game is in the way of, like, levels, worlds, puzzles, and what have you, because I skip them all while I'm speedrunning. <laughs> I just have vague memories here and there. And that's where this series comes in. We'll be getting all 120 stars in the game, but with a semi-blind twist. After all, I'm probably one of the few nerds left who hasn't memorized this game forwards and backwards, right? <laughs> so join me in discovering this loved classic of the ages while I get everyone off my back about actually playing it through. Because I've been nagged more than twice. More than three times, in fact. I've been nagged many times to actually play this game for real. So, here we are! <laughs> And in case you're wondering, my best time as of posting this episode for my 16 star runs is 23 minutes and 17 seconds. So I still have a lot of room to grow, but still, you know, I got the basics. <laughs> anyway, here we go. Let us jump into the game. I'm actually very excited about this. Um, these files are actually the original files that my mom had when she played this game a lot, so that's fun. Unfortunately, I had to get rid of her 120 star save file when I started speedrunning. Sorry, Mom. <laughs> anyway, let's go with Mario A. Start up a new file. Dear Mario, please come to the castle. I have baked a cake for you. Yours truly, Princess Toadstool. Peach. Peach! <laughs> How sweet of you, Peach. If I, if I, you know, it just feels weird watching this... Watching this cutscene with the context of a Let's Play because I've seen it so many freaking times Trying to speed through it and like, you know, power through and get as best time as I can But since this is a more casual series and I'm Discovering the game for essentially the first time through and through uh, We're going to be taking it very very easy. So don't expect me to move fast I'm gonna be poking around and climbing random trees and seeing what things do in this. And for the first time, I'm actually going to be reading these text boxes. Uh, ciao, you've reached Princess Toadstool's castle via a warp pipe. Using the controller as a piece of cake. Oh, wow. They're actually telling me how to press A and how to attack. Press B to read signs, too. Use a control stick in the center of the controller to move Mario around. Now head for the castle. Mm -hmm. What if I don't want to head for the castle? I've done that so many times mm -hmm. now. Princess Toadstool's castle is just ahead, even though you can see it right there. Uh, alright, so these are just tutorial modes. Cool. Man, this feels strange. So while we're going through this, I am going to be taking my time, but when I reach a point where I know a trick that I can actually perform, I'm going to be doing something similar to this. Uh, I will be including it in just like a picture-in-picture, picture. hello, this is how you do the Lakitu skip. You can skip on either side of the bridge, but the left side is generally easier, I think. You just have to, like, ride that very edge because Lakitu's text box has a hip box that is basically the center, but it leaves out the sides. Interesting. Mario has just arrived out on scene and will be filming the action live as he enters the castle and pursues the missing power stars. As, as seasoned cameraman, uh, as seasoned cameraman, oh, there's more than one, will be shooting from the recommended angle, but you can change the camera angle by pressing the C buttons. If we can't adjust the view any further, we'll buzz take a, take, to take a look at the surrounding stop and press C up. Alright, cool. Thank you very much for tutorials. 
All right, so that's how we'll be handling uh, little tricks that I know. I do want to include them at least a little bit, so uh, they'll just be in passing. Welcome. No one's home. Now scram and don't come back. Gwahaha. Man, it feels really weird to actually be reading these text boxes. Am I glad to see you, the princess and I, and well, everybody, we're all trapped inside the castle walls. Bowser has stolen this castle stars, and he's using their power to create his own world in the paintings and walls. Please recover the power stars. As you find them, you can use their power to open the doors that Bowser has sealed. There are four rooms on the first floor, starting the one with the painting of the bomb bomb inside. It's the only room that Bowser hasn't sealed. All right, cool. Uh, that means this one! Here we go! Now, uh, I might be jumping around with the worlds a little bit, just a teeny tiny bit, but I'm gonna be- I'm gonna try and, like, stick to what the actual mission is. So right now, we have Big bob -omb on the summit. So, uh, usually I'd be going for the Chain Chomp one that's, like, right over there, just off screen, but, uh, I'm gonna be sticking with the specific mission that I select, so just running through how we're gonna be handling this series. Uh, you're smack dab in the middle of the battlefield, we found the power star that Bowser stole inside the painting worlds. Uh, first talk to the bob on buddy, press B to talk, he'll certainly help you out, and so will his comrades in other areas. Uh, yes, you already told me how to read signs, thank you. Sorry, I didn't mean to punch your face. If you wander around here, you're liable to be plastered by a water bomb. Those bomb those enemy bomb bombs love to fight. They're always finding ways to attack. This metal has become a battlefield ever since the big bomb bomb got his paws on the power star. Uh, all right, cool. So it's basically basic fare. Go get power star, and we do we do good things. Hey, you! It's dangerous ahead, so listen up. Take my advice. Cross the two bridges ahead, then head for the falling water bombs. The big bob at the top of the mountain is very powerful. Don't let him grab you. We're bob buddies, and we're on your side. You can talk to us whenever you'd like to. Cool. Okay, so pink ones are good. Black ones are evil. So, uh, we're good. So we have to go across. We have red coins, so I'm not interested in those right now. Bye-bye, chomp-chomp! Uh, let's see. Is there anything on the other side? There's the water bombs. Oh, this is a cannon thing. Now, I vaguely remember something about this. Can you? Ah, yes, here we go. Gimme. Gimme one up. Gimme one up. Thank you. Okay, so uh, a couple of memories are coming back here and there, but we're going to be trying our best. What's down there? Uh, is that the way up? No. No, this is the way up. Uh, no visitors allowed by decree of the big bob mom. I shall never surrender my stars where they hold the power of the castle in their, uh, glow? Uh, they were a gift from Bowser, the Koopa King himself, and they lie well hidden within my realm. Now a whisper of their whereabouts shall leave my lips all right. Perhaps just one hint. Heed the star names at the beginning of the course. Okay, yes, I, I got that, thanks. All right, so while we are climbing said mountain, I guess I can run through a couple of other things. There was a remake for this game, as I'm sure a lot of you already knew. Wait, can I jump up here? Can I do this? Uh, this looks like something I should be able to like jump up. Uh, maybe? Can I? Nope. Okay. <laughs> uh, I'll just I'll just go the normal way. Anyway, there was a remake for the DS that I'm sure a lot of you are aware of. Uh, we will be covering info from that game, not like through it completely, but at least the stages that were added to it. Uh, but we will be doing that after the main game of the N64 version is wrapped up. So that's how that's how we're gonna handle that. We will cover it later, so don't worry. Uh, but again, not the whole game, just the things that this game does not have. Uh, and speaking of which, Big thanks to- wait, where does this go? I remember that this, like, disintegrates you or something? How do? What do? Okay, it does nothing. <laughs> uh, big thanks to Chugga Conroy because Meal was kind enough to compile a list of all of the things that I probably should know in a blind playthrough, like stages that I can't complete without power-ups. As well as differences between the DS version and the N64 version. So thank you, Emil, very, very much. Uh, 
I'm the big baba, lord of all blasting matter, king of the kabooms and the world over. How dare you scale my mountain? By what right do you set foot on my imperial mountaintop? You may have eluded my guards, but you'll never escape my grasp. And you'll never take away my power star. I hereby challenge you, Mario! Uh, if you want the star I hold, you must prove yourself in battle. Can you pick me up from the back and hurl me into this royal turf? I think you cannot. Um, okay, so he, he real slow. He real slow. Pick him up. Excuse me, I said pick up. Pick. Pick up. Pick. Heck yeah, toss. This is very basic. Pick up. Toss. Another one? Okay. Pick up. Pick up, I said. And toss. Uh, whoa, what? Can it be that a pipsqueak like you has defused the bob -omb king? You might be fast enough to ground me, but you'll have to pick up the pace if you want to take King Bowser by the tail. <laughs> oh, pick up the pace, you say? Methinks my troops could learn a lesson from you. Here's your star, as I promised, Mario. If you want to see me again, select the star from the menu. For now, farewell. I don't know why I want to see you again, but okay. Uh, speedrun tip! Never mind, I didn't do it right. <laughs> if you ground pound when you collect the star, you actually hit the ground much faster than I just did. So, there you go. Pro tip. Uh, you've recovered one of the stolen power stars. Now you can open up some of the sealed doors in the castle. Try the princess's room on the second floor and the room with the painting of Womp's Fortress on floor one. Bowser's troops are still gaining power, so you can't give up. Save us, Mario. Keep searching for stars. Uh, I think I'm gonna go back into this one, actually. We're, we'll stick to this one for this episode. Foot race with Koopa the Quick. Oh. Oh, Koopa the Quick! Oh, Koopa the Quick! Oh, I know you! Uh, we're peace-loving mamas, so we don't use cannons, but if you'd like to blast off, we don't mind. Help yourself. I'll prepare all the cannons in this course for you to use. Bon voyage! Oh! Huh! <laughs> okay! Cool! You know what? I didn't expect that to happen. I guess that unlocks all of them. Ready for blast off? Come on, hop into the cannon. Mm, you can reach the star on the floating island by using the four cannons. Neat. Neat. Okay. Do you have anything else to say? That was useful. Are you useful too? Uh, the big ball bomb is nothing but a big dud now, but the battle for the castle has just begun. Other enemies are holding the power stars. If you recover more stars, you can open up new doors that lead to new worlds. Okay. This is all this is all very very basic. Even though I don't know what any of them say, it's very very basic tutorial fodder. Uh, hey Mario, is it true that you beat the big bob? I'm cool. You must be strong and pretty fast. So how fast are you anyway? Fast enough to beat me, Koopa the Quick? I don't think so. Just try me. Uh, how about a race to the mountain top where the big bob -omb was? What do you say when I say go? Let the race begin. So is this where the cannon comes in? I is this like a cheat? Do I get to cheat? Let's see where this takes me. Uh, alright. Oh, this is a little bit awkward. Heck! Yeah, oh, this is not where I expected to get blasted. Where is Koopa the Quick? I hope that I did this right. Is he behind me? Okay, I'm doing I'm doing okay. Look look at me. Unless he's already like way past here, which you know, knowing my luck. I think this one leads up top. Nope. No, 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 no. Go in. Yes. Yes. Okay, good. Up top? Heck yes! I did it! 49 seconds. Where you at, boy? Where you at? Man, you, you sure are taking your time. Wait, actually, where is he? I don't even see him. Well, oh, there he is! Oh, here he come! He be coming around the corner when he come. He be coming around the corner when he come. You got nothing on speed running, Mario. Here you are. Come on and talk to me. You lost. Hey, hey, don't try to scam me. Oh. <laughs> oh. Look me up when you want to race for. Oh, I lost. What? 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 It didn't count! Really? It didn't count? For real? Oh, you know what? 
Oops. I didn't know that he would care. You know, I probably should have guessed that. I probably should have predicted that that would happen. You know, I'm I'm a little bit I'm a little bit sad that I did not predict that happening. But does that mean I can't use the cannon, or was it just the whole warpy thing that I did? It can't be the cannon. It can't be the cannon. Let's do the cannon again. Down you go. Alright, well, here we go. It only took me, like, ten more seconds to do it the legit way. Okay, where are you? If he still says that I cheated because I used a cannon, then screw him. Come on, my dude. You can run faster. Here he comes. Here he comes. Uh... Oh, he does care about the cannon! He does care about the cannon! What the heck? Alright, but can we talk about what a trap that is that you unlock the cannon? <laughs> You unlock the cannon right when a race is involved that disqualifies you. That is actually a trap. Alright, it's no biggie. I can do this. I can do this without cheating. I just wanted to use the cannon because it was new and shiny. And you know, it was there. In fact, I think this is faster than using the cannon. I think I got here faster than using the cannon in the previous attempt. Oh well, it's fine, you know. Whatever makes him feel better. Alright, here we go. Let us not take the warp just in case. He's like way the heck back there anyway. We're not gonna lose this. Unless I die. Whoop. There we go. <laughs> yep, it was faster than without the cannon. Alright, gotta wait for him again. Hey, Koopa! Huh, you really are fast! A human blur, here you go, you've won it fair and square. Thank you very, very much. All right, not bad, not bad. We did it. Uh, all right, let's do one more stage, cause that was kind of bad. How I just screwed around that entire time. Shoot to the island in the sky. Oh, this is the one for the uh, for this thing. All right, let's just drop down. All right, how does one do this? I assume that it means that one. But I don't think that this is gonna get me there. Most certainly did not. Oh, I'm gonna break my neck. How does Mario not break his neck? I would like to know that. Uh, alright, so this is a cannon as well. Maybe if I just shoot straight up? Alright, here's the island. Straight up. Well, maybe I should not have gone straight up. Oh no, this is fine. Uh Sometimes if you pass through a coin ring or find a secret point in the course, a red number will appear. If you trigger five red numbers, a secret star will show up. Oh, that's actually a helpful hint. Cool! Nice! <laughs> some, of, some of these stars are over real fast, aren't they? You've recovered three power stars, now you can open any door with a three on its star. You can come and go from the open courses as you please. The enemies ahead are even meaner, so be careful. I live for mean enemies. But I think we're going to go ahead and wrap things up here. In the next episode, we're going to be, uh, I don't know, maybe making a little bit more headway into this. And maybe possibly going into a new world. I will see you guys then. Messina out. Hello.
Quack, 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 quack,